Hello, what's up? This is do a, diff a different review of all my duct tape stuff. Got a bunch of different things here. I'm going to start with these flowers I made a long time ago. And they're actually flowers wrapped around little wooden skewers. They're actually very nice and they add a nice touch to any flower pot. Very nice. My second thing is my iTouch case that is still in use. I use it every day. It's simply duct tape, but on the back, it's got Gerd from Vivis Him, and I really, really love this. This is my favorite thing. I've actually had people who bought these because they wanted it so badly, so I made, I make them them. So, that's my blend. My next thing is my wallets, which are my biggest thing that I've made so far. I'm going to start from oldest to new. I'll fan them out for you. Yeah. I've made a couple new ones. Some of them are on my older video, but I thought I'd do a newer view because my voice is back and stuff. So my oldest wallet, which is my first wallet, and I rarely ever use this unless I'm going to Magic Mountain or somewhere, is my kanji wallet. And it says strength, happiness, and love. And then on the inside is a regular billfold and a little ID holder. Didn't work very well. And two pockets. And then I'm actually wearing, I made bracelets to go along with it. They're right here. They say peace and strength. So that's that wallet. Um, I, my next wallet that I made was my Silent Hill wallet, which is my favorite wallet that I made. It's not exactly the most, like, it's it's my best wallet, not my best wallet. It has some good features on it, and it's not, it, it's actually, it's not like the best uh, uh, work, best work. Because it's not, it's a little bit made improperly. But on the front, welcome to Silent Hill. There's a little key, which you pull it through the keyhole, and the wallet opens. And when you open it, there's a small, there's a bloody pocket right here. that fits two card holders, a ID holder, and I think this is run. But on the inside, as Velcro, it says, it's a, a little chibi pyramid head that I made. And also a thing that says emergency supply. In this one, it has two more billfolds. And in inside the wallet is another thing that says supplies. From all of Silent Hill games. And that one has a bracelet too. Hold on. This one has a bracelet too, and I actually thought of this myself. It's a secret. I really like that one. That's probably my favorite slogan of a wallet bracelet. My next wallet is my West Ranch wallet. I haven't used this for a while because there's not really season. But it says, it has the logo on the front, a little blue tab. That has a bracelet too. But it says SP on it for my initials. Then it has got yellow billfold liners and a double-sided card holder. It's got five credit card holders and a thing that says go Wildcats. That's that wallet. Let me put this back in there. My next wallet is my eye wallet, which I made actually overnight one day. And it comes with an eye bracelet. And then it says iWallet, and it has an apple on it. It's iWallet. And then on the inside, it has logos. ID, iLib for my library card, iMovie for my movie card, iGame, and iFroyo. You can figure that one out. And then on the inside, it says there's a bill for that. I like this one. It was a very simple wallet. And now, my next wallet is a simple one I made for a display. It's just an R, because that's a generic thing. 
four bill bowl, four bill things. Yeah, in the red, it's red. My this one I made for my grandma, and I'm giving it to her soon. It has a greyhound on the front, and it's actually a change, not really a billfold. It has a credit, I mean credit card holder. It has this really neat design and the fancy duct tape, and it has this line down it. It's got three credit card holders on this side, and three on this side, so it makes six. And that's it. And finally, well not finally, but my last regular wallet is this one. I'm not exactly, can anyone tell me what this means? Because I didn't really look it up. But I made it just out of a whim, because I had this army duct tape. So, you open it. I just made this. It's got an ID holder, a secret bill pocket back here, and three on this side for a total of four credit card holders. On the inside, it's got this pattern with the star on both sides. That's that wallet. Now for my seasonal wallets. I make these wallets for when it's a certain holiday. So my first one, which is I just stopped using because Halloween's over, Jagger Liner. And has got Velcro and got two bracelets that say Happy Halloween. It's got a little trick-or-treat bag on here. It's got three credit card holders and an ID holder with another secret compartment and a little billfold with, an, with a negative, which is kind of cool. I like that. And my next one is my Thanksgiving wallet, which is in use right now. It's got a little picture of Snoopy holding a, a turkey. And it's got a little pile of leaves covered up by Velcro. Let's see. And on the inside, it has this little tree with, it has, it's got five credit card holders. And the billfold is actually leaves, which I made. They're very hard to make. And then on the back is my ID holder. Well, that's it, and I'll see you later. Bye.